couple minutes, little sister. And I decided to write a poem about Rachel's art today to share with you. But before, I do want to touch about the person that Rachel was. Um, if you had the pleasure to know Rachel, she was the most unique person. And as her little sister, you know, I didn't realize that because that was all I knew. I didn't know life with, without Rachel. And as I grew up older, I realized how unique she was, how singular her soul was, how she identified as Rachel, not as a girl, not as a person. She identified as Rachel. And I want all of you to identify as you, as Olivia, as Parma, as Elisa, as you, as your soul. My poem is called The Art of Rachel, and I do want to say I do feel her in this room, and she loved Parma so much, and you were such a mentor to her, and you made her create, and that was hard for people to do, and she needed a push to create or something to reach a goal, and you did that for her, and she needed that. The Art of Rachel. A rare beauty, an unusual stillness. Dark colors glowing with light. Bright and bold, sharp and strong. Mysterious and alluring. Lines form into shapes. Shapes form into beings. Beings illuminating forever frozen on canvas. Creatures of the dark and light becoming one. Twisted vines and weathered woods. Beautiful bodies morphing human and animal. Real in fantasy creating its own reality. Each pen mark destined by genius pure talent. Each stroke of paint with such ease and precision. Each piece of clay molded to perfection by her gifted hands. Everlasting magic, everlasting creativity, Unique, singular, the essence of beauty. Indigo blue, I love you, the art of Rachel. Thank you guys for being here. Oh,